What's up guys, I'm Mr. Alan C and we're checking out the Smart Battery Charger Maintainer from HTRC. Let's see what's in the box. Alright, we can see this comes neatly packaged and well protected in the box. And a big digital screen on this. And if we go down here, we do have the accessories for it. So, this is made to charge and maintain batteries as stated. But take a look at the options here. This is compatible with electric golf carts, so take a look how this is made to just connect in there and maintain and charge the battery. We also have the standard negative and positive battery chargers, so you can connect this to your golf cart battery. Specific model offers 36 volt and 48 volt battery charging and maintenance. Very cool, and yeah. You can switch through the various modes right here and switch between the 36 volt and 48 voltage here. Point out these are two separate cables. So I've plugged this one in on this side right here. It clicks into place and it's ready for use. If we take a look at the left side of the device, we're going to see where we plugged in the AC cable. Let me remind you that is very long. So that's really handy. We got the main power switch right here that means it's ready to go lighten up that nice backlit screen and when we turn this on and connect it you're going to be able to see the exact power level of your battery and how it's doing so what do you want to do you can switch between the modes so they got the different battery options charge options or the repair option which is really cool and that's what's going to display your overall battery's level and help you get it boosted so it's full. Very cool. Let's say you want to get rid of this one. You just pull that out and you just connect these. These would just plug right in there as well. Also, I didn't show you the little fan right here to keep this unit cool. So yeah, overall, such a nice unit. It's got grips on the bottom so it's not sliding around. Thanks for checking this out with me, guys. I enjoyed showing it to you. I hope this helps answer any questions you might have had.